All right, thousands of fans donated more than $200,000 the week after the game, and Morstead is donated all to Children's Hospital in Minnesota. He was there to hand out the check this afternoon, and our own Katie Steiner caught up with him. She joins us live now from Minnesota with more. Katie? Hey guys, yeah, Morstead and his wife came all the way up to Minnesota just to give this check to the hospital, and the presentation was pretty emotional. This has been really unexpected. And um, the reason I'm so nervous is not because I can't talk into a mic. Um, this is like a culmination of a lot of people. You could just tell it meant so much to him. He handed over more than $200,000, and it all goes to Children's Hospital here in Minnesota for a very specific program called Child Life. Now, Child Life is a program that works with kids and their families more on the emotional part of their sickness and emotionally getting better. Now, the kids even wrote him a poem, and it was adorable. Take a listen. If thank you were a color, it'd be all the colors of the rainbow. If thank you were a taste, it would be the taste of cookies, the kind you take out of the oven and eat when they're warm. If thank you were a picture, it would be like a birthday party and you're opening all your presents. If thank you were a sound, it would be the sound of a firecracker on the 4th of July. Um, I'd like to thank Thomas and his foundation for getting back to a program that has completely changed my life and um, going through this illness. Um, it's been really tough, but... Child life has always been there. And Thomas Moore said so that he was in tears after that young girl read that poem. They also gave that poem to him on a plaque, so he'll always have it. Now coming up at 10 o'clock, I'll tell you a little bit more about child life and why it's so important to Morstead and what Morstead wants you to do about it as well. But for now, reporting in Minnesota, Katie Steiner, Eyewitness News. So many heroes in that one story. Thanks very much, Katie.